In the enchanting village of West Java, Dayang Sumbi, a virtuous weaver known for her beauty and kindness, sits at her loom, her delicate fingers expertly weaving a magnificent cloth. Dayang Sumbi faces a crisis in her weaving, her thread tangling and knotting into an unsalvageable mess. Desperate, she closes her eyes and prays for help. Suddenly, a mystical dog named Tumong emerges from the shadows, its fur glowing with a divine light. It nudges forward, offering a shimmering thread to Dayang Sumbi, who gazes at it in disbelief. As the years pass, Sankuryang, a strong and handsome young man, explores the depths of the forest. One day he stumbles upon a mysterious girl, unaware that she is the very same Dayang Sumbi who once encountered Tumong. The preparations for Sankuryang and Dayang Sumbi's wedding are in full swing. Dayang Sumbi, now adorned in a stunning wedding attire, looks at Sankuryang with love and sorrow, for she knows the truth about their shared destiny. In a tender moment, Dayang Sumbi's fingers brush against Sankuryang's arm, revealing a birthmark in the shape of a familiar symbol. Her heart sinks as she realizes that Sankuryang is her own long-lost son. Dayang Sumbi, her eyes filled with both sadness and hope, sets a seemingly impossible challenge for Sankuryang. She hopes it will prevent their wedding and protect him from the consequences of their forbidden love. Undeterred by the challenge, Sankuryang embarks on a perilous quest, surrounded by mystical creatures of the forest who have pledged their aid. Each step forward showcases his unwavering determination to overcome any obstacle. As dawn nears, the sky transforms into a breathtaking canvas of vivid hues. Sankuryang stands on the edge of completing the impossible challenge, his heart swelling with anticipation. In a cruel twist, Dayang Sumbi, overwhelmed by fear, clasps her hands together in a desperate prayer. Her sorrowful expression deceives Sankuryang, leading him to believe that he has failed the challenge. Consumed by rage and betrayal, Sankuryang delivers a mighty kick to a seemingly harmless wooden boat. But in an instant, it transforms into the mighty Mount Tungkuban Parahu, accompanied by a thunderous rumble and cascading rocks. The story takes its final turn as we witness the consequences of broken promises. The Bandung Valley, once a dammed river, now embraces the pristine beauty of nature forever reminding us of the enduring influence of Javanese legends.